I think we're just about ready to get going here. A warm welcome to you wherever you are in the world. The teams then, Tunisia against France. I'm Peter Drury and providing analysis and expert opinion alongside me will be Jim Beglin. Well, thanks, Peter. There's a great sense of anticipation in this stadium. and I've been hit by it too. We stand for the national anthem of France. Tunisia proudly line up for their national anthem. Tunisia shape up in a 4-3-3. Yeah, it's quite simple, Peter, really. With the ball, it's 4-3-3, and without the ball, it becomes 4-5-1. we go then Jim you've played in games of this nature who can make the difference well the very exciting Antoine Griezmann uh, he has an impeccable first touch and with the ball under control he can use as many skills and and swift changes of direction in, in running from out to win and he wreaks havoc I'm thinking the same he will be a central feature no doubt Pops it in gently, too much on it, and that's the keepers. Rabio, Griezmann, Conte, Rafael Varan, Conte, Rafael Varan, Conte, Griezmann. And it's Benzema. Rabio goes up and over. Shade too heavy. Keeper can pick that up. Plays it out to the wing. Hoists it high. And he's onside. Shoots! Been leave it clear. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Seems now to be all about width. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of the ball as possible. Looking for a corner. by the keeper 
Now it's Kasri. He's through, now is he in? Pogba. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Now a chance to break. Battling for the right to play in the early stages. Kasri. Kante battles to win it back. Out wide to the right. Gets into some space. He's got away. Can he finish? He can get that clear. And it's Griezmann. Now the pass. Up he gets! Goal! France! France are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. France take the lead, 1-0. It's so often the case with goal scorers, little influence, and all of a sudden, bang. So what now? Goes long. In with a header! Loris sends that a long way. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Chance to break. Stuck out a leg for a good challenge. Griezmann. Conte passes it through. Is on the back foot. Played out to the wing. There's a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Pogba. Rafael Varan. Griezmann tries lifting it over. Play for a goal kick. And it's Benzema. Oh, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Well, this man's contribution is, as you would expect, proving terrific. Well, not only can a player of such high calibre show the imagination to set up a goal, but he can also produce when the pressure's on to deliver a big moment. This guy was born to create. He's had a shot! Tries to get it forward quickly. Rabio. Long and high towards the flank. Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority, uh, a cause of mild frustration. 
deftly done. Looks like a good ball through. Boots it to safety. Pogba goes looking. Benzema. Tunisia are in need of a lift as we head up towards the break. Loose ball, who's going to get there? Gets it upfield. Oh, good interception. Sprint it wide. Now here's the through ball. Uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Tried to play it through. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Big chance, it's Kashi! Great build-up, it all deserved a better ending. It was such a clever idea to lift it into his path. Poorly directed kick from the keeper, he's given it away. Benzema looks to slip it through. Forward it goes. One shell pass, that's the message there. Conte. And it's Pogba. And the weighted pass. Keeps everyone guessing. Into the box. It's out for a goal kick. That's a poor kick by the keeper, he's just given it straight back. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. And that'll be the final action of the first half. There we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. That gets things going for the second half. Tunisia don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back, though. The keeper's got good distance on that. Kazri plays it out to the flank and helps available out wide. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. And through to the goalkeeper. Tries to stroke it through. Baran positions himself well and cuts it out. Conte sends it forward with interest. Keeper goes long. Out to the left it goes. Rabio aimed long and direct. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Griezmann, and it's Benzema. Rabio, Griezmann set up one goal so far. Looks like a good ball through. Rabio. He's had a shot! That really should have hit the net. Well, the most exciting sight on a football pitch. He had too much trickery for that defence. Brilliant. It's a poor kick by the keeper, being intercepted. France are keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. No 
both sides a bit too casual in possession. So who's he picking out? Over to the left. Shoots! That's a half-decent try. Yeah, he may have snatched at that a bit, even though it was quite close. Forward it goes. Kasri. Rabio plays it forward. Plays it into the channel. Well read, he sorted that out. Gets it upfield. That's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. He's gone for it! Tunisia showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Spot on, Peter. That could spell trouble. Yet another to add to football's endless list of could-haves and should-haves. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. If only the, the pass could have completed its journey. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. And it's hoisted clear. France get it back again. Passes it through. Now the pass. Has a swing at it! Oh, the ball's cut and... Oh! Goal! Two to the good! They have breathing space! Rabio with a predatory goal. Well, for me, that's just pure predatory brilliance. It's not so much the finish, but the way he read the situation when nobody else was even alert to it. It's fantastic. France get themselves a two-goal cushion. That second goal has such a, a polarizing effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. Timely intervention. Pogba. Tunisia haven't made a substitution yet. And it's Benzema. Well positioned to make that interception. Tries a through ball. And a goal kick. Benzema, Conte, Rabio, Dinks one in, Benzema, and the ball is out of play. Looks to slip it through. Now here's the through ball. Has a hit! Griezmann tries to get it forward quickly. 
looks to clip it forward. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, the idea was right, the delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. He's left his man. Tries lifting it over. Little accusatory stare there tells the whole story. Tunisia just had to make the ball stick, but came up short. No, no way through there. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Chip through. That was one quality pass away from being a very decent chance. Looked very promising. Uh, that was just poor decision making and a weak execution. Now it's Benzema. Just brushed off the ball there. Keeper's got good distance on that. Baran gets into the right position to intercept. Is that a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. He's had a look. Benzema turns and goes back. And it's Benzema. Look. Benzema! And he's there to make a great save. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. run he's making on the right Pogba gets it back looks to dink one in hit into the middle that intervention was very necessary Benzema his goal scoring skills have already been evident Now the counter. Benzema proving impossible to wrestle off the ball. Rabio, now the pass. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. Tunisia beaten here. They might well feel aggrieved, but the result is everything. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? Inevitable in terms of the result, but that doesn't tell.